I spend my days starving for human contact. I do have one friend, but he usually only contacts me one to two times per week. So I go through a lot of the week without any human connections and it really gets to me and I'm not sure what to do about it other than what I'm already doing about it which is reaching out to the world and asking for friendships but this methodology seems not to be working very well because I still spend my days isolated and talking to no one and I write about this a lot more in my blog. I'm a lot more open with this in my blog because I don't want my channel to be a depressing channel, but I don't care about my blog. I want my channel to be uplifting, so I try to make it uplifting even though my life is not doing very well socially. It's so annoying because I want to be a social butterfly and spend my days talking to people, but the public isn't very open to creating relationships online, which makes it really difficult for me to find friends. This is a big sociological issue. What are people that are isolated to do in life to create and form social connections? If you weren't brought up and grounded in a good social environment then it's a good chance that you don't have many solid social connections and if you don't have these social connections then what are you going to do about it? Like, for me, the answer was to document my own life online, publicly, and try and attract people with like minds to me. But, most people aren't content producers and this would be very difficult for a lot of people, especially socially isolated people, because they might not have the social skills like I do to effectively communicate a message. If what I was doing actually worked and it attracted friendships into my life, then that would inspire other lonely people to become online personalities. And I think that lonely people could really make the most of documenting their lives online because they could process their feelings about everything through their work and that would help them develop as a person and I would be there 
as a friend, so lonely people, do you want to not be lonely anymore? Then you should contact me, and I can help you create an online diary in which you can document your thoughts and feelings. I think that people that don't suffer from loneliness would have a difficult time empathizing with what I'm going through, but the people who have experienced loneliness in their life will probably understand exactly where I am coming from. When I first started all of this, I did not want fame. I just wanted to find a few people who would do this with me. But as time went on, I realized that I needed that fame in order to find others who would be willing to do this with me. So now I seek fame. Fame could solve all of my problems. I would no longer be lonely and I would be doing what I love best and I would be helping the world become a better place for doing it. There is no easy solution to solve long-term loneliness. It will take a lot of hard work and dedication daily in order to resolve it. You aren't going to just randomly find a new friend who will be good to you in this world. You need to make those possibilities into potential realities. And that is going to take a lot of hard work. Most people in this world are not good hearted. So you have to be really careful with who you allow into your life. You must protect your heart at all costs. I am not looking for just any friends. For the most part, my work filters out those people that I don't want in my life and the ones who stick around to watch and read are the ones that I want in my life. Go ahead, contact me. All of the social media links are in the description. It says a lot about the heart that can experience productions like this and not contact me. It says a lot about the heart of someone that watches another in pain scream out in agony and them not reach out to him. Please! I need friends!
friendships. Yet another video that will get watched and forgotten about with most likely no one taking action, leaving me yet again always isolated and alone. I dream of a world where the loners can come together and no longer be lonely if we only join hands and unite our voices then maybe we will one day be able to create a better future for our youth. Shouldn't we create structures that are worth passing down to the next generation? Tell me in the comments, what do I have to do to convince you to be my friend? I appreciate your attention span. Until next time, this is Wendell and Sophia signing off.